naturally when i hear the, the name um struggle card mm-hmm. people attribute that name to a gangster how did you get mm-hmm. reputation of a gangster <laughs> friends your associate and mm. just small-minded people at the same time you feel what i'm saying because to defend your family i don't see how you could go down in the book as a gangster you know what i mean Mm. To defend anybody you love, I don't see how you could go down in the book as a gangster. Because remember, we don't play offense, we only play defense. So it's mm. like if you're in trouble, us, we won't trouble you, you feel me? Mm. Yeah. A lot of people would have said um, some of the money from the peace program were being used to fund criminal activities also. What kind of criminal activities? What kind? When them say some of the, the man them show they're all going to buy a new machine with the peace money. <sighs> Man, you see people, mm. but people gonna always got bad things to say about positive movements. You understand, and that's something that people within, you know what I mean, and who are part of the positive movement gonna got black out. You feel what I'm saying? Because, mm. like I say, easy to go down. The wrong road, the negative road, you feel what I'm saying? You know, take nothing. It's the people them say, girls love street men. Is that true? Well, all these street men got kind of energy what a woman really need. You, know? you understand what I'm saying? Like, mm. you won't find no jacket and tie man gonna pull over and girl every guy in them bush there. You know what I mean? Like, you know what I mean? Yeah, like, real talk, so. Yeah. You know, it gives them one a little memories, dog. You know what I mean? Passing through. Yeah. See, so like, bye. Bye, bye. I remember a man cut me up right there. You understand? Yeah, a little yeah. memories. So, yeah. I would say, that's mainly the reason why. Mm. Yeah. It was alleged that an artist was beaten. Alleged. Allegedly. And it's um, struggle them being called. Struggle's team name being called. Is that true? As far as the artists, that ain't true. The artists being beaten, mm-hmm. that ain't true. Mm-hmm. But the artist friend, yeah. Highlight is the athletes, man. Highlight family from right up the road up there. Mm-hmm. And highlight guy to be like, he can't come at least and all these kind of dummy things like, somebody after he you know what i mean mm-hmm. which is far from that you know what i'm saying mm-hmm. how you like brother we pass to heal me your mother we pass to heal me so how are you gonna heal all these people but yet trying to tear down your son i tell you dude like attention man people remember on the 18th of may on Pinnis beach sunshine perspectives media is keeping it its first official event a thing called enchanting colors affair you see me we have the likes of collision band sweet sister sincere and extortion sound out of saint kids from underneath this and we have dj smudge sg presidential blackstone family new level you see me just to name a few and we also have the core band out of nevis you see me ticket prices are 25 EC dollars, yes, me. Imagine so much entertainment for twenty-five dollar. Can't miss that. That had a big party, the eighteenth of me, yes, me. So we are go, we are go party at the enchanting colors of fear in a nevis, the eighteenth of me, and then we are go breaking down the twentieth, go end of the weekend. Cause it's a holiday weekend, you know. Yes, me. So something is actually keeping in Nevis. And it's not an expensive party. Yes, me? So if you look for a place to lime upon the 18th of May 2024, Sunshine, Nevis. I tolerate men. We live in a risky world, you know? Yeah, that's <laughs> what so I can say. And, uh, you know, we explore. Men should always spend on a Appreciation is a big man. Welcome back or welcome to another episode of the Perspectives Podcast. People are wonder what, you probably wonder where I'm at right now, but um for the second time we are shoot an interview in a shipment yard. Is it but today and a spar we are resuming. 
very easy with the owner, the CEO. Struggle, you know what I mean? A lot of a lot of a lot of things have been said about this struggle, you know what I mean? So essential and perspectives media is here to find out who is this struggle? What is he all about? You know what I mean? Is he a gangster, as some would say? So we they have to find out if the rumors are truth, you know? Who is this struggle? Is it because as far as me you know he's a businessman? But struggle, who are you? Uh, businessman, mm. a businessman slash fisherman. Yeah, yeah. So give me, give me some background, like who you really be, like where did you grow up, where in Saint Kitts you actually from? Okay, yeah. Mm. Mm. And how how was it growing up in Kenya? Like what kind of family you come from? Good family. Mm. Good family, middle class. Good family. With you in Kenya and Kenya, I'm from mm. Kenya. And what, what was Kian like back in them days? Then? Good. A nice village to live in. Mm. Yeah. So life for you with, with your middle class family was was good. Yeah. Like you, good. you didn't say. have you, you didn't grow up in a struggling home. Well yeah, the struggle what day about yeah, you don't know. Mm. Yeah. Normal thing. And you completed high school? Well, no. From first to fourth. So what caused you not to complete? <laughs> maybe maybe company, I will say. Mm. Yeah. What kind of company? <laughs> Bad ones. <laughs> yeah, so like like what kind of trouble is it? You used to fight a lot in school? Like you used to fight in school and them things now? Well, no one again. No one again. Not too often. No mm. one again. So how did you how did you get expelled from school? Or what caused you to stop going to school? Well, I would say most of the rasta liberty. Mm. The rasta liberty going mountain. You know what I mean? Being around the rasta man them. Like, you know what I mean? The teaching us different so. Mm. Yeah. I would say. Yeah, so you used to just not go to school, go on a mountain. Well, I used to go to school every day, bro. Every day. Every day, but Ford Farm, no Ford Farm is like, you know what I mean? Go when you feel like, mm. you know what I mean? Then the mountain, the mountain had me away, so you don't know everything, so you just get up all together. Mm. Yeah. And from high school, where, where did life lead, lead for you? From my school, from my school, I went to America. Mm. Yeah. So you 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 lived in America or you just went for like a, a little I live in America. For how long how long you stayed in America? Mm, about twelve, ten years. Mm. Yeah. So what what was it like moving to America? Like from St. Kitts, the life where you used to in St. Kitts, then moving to America. I I I said no nah, man. You know what I mean? Different feeling, but you know what I mean? Normal living. Mm. Yeah. So you didn't get like a culture shock where certain things were used to home, it kind of different because now you see different people from different backgrounds with different lifestyle. Yeah, for sure. For sure, 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 sure. Mm. Well, the area where I was is most yardy. You know what I mean? So, mm. you don't know. Kind of similar? Yes. Yeah. Mm. And what kind of profession or what, what were you doing in America for them 12 years? Hmm. Hmm. But we don't skip that, that one. Eh? Yeah. All right. I don't think YouTube gone. Well, I mean, you probably can, you probably can, it's stories, you know, it don't happen that how long ago? Like, years um, ago? Yeah. Yeah, that like, more 10 years now. Uh, I say seven. More than seven years now. Yeah, so it basically, you were living a street life in America yeah, then? Yeah, definitely. Mm. Definitely. Yeah. And what caused, you to, what caused you to come back to St. Kitts? Hmm. Gun charge, drug charge, and bail jumping charges. Mm. Yeah. So you were deported to St. Kitts? Yeah. And <clears throat> being deported to St. Kitts now, um, how was that like? 
because it's one thing to live in America and then you're used to a certain lifestyle in America, I guess. Then to come back home now mm -hmm. as a deportee. Mm -hmm. It's not like you come back home as a regular, regular civilian, you come back as a deportee. What was that like? Well, I'll be honest with you. You know when you don't like, you don't make up your mind. Mm. Like, my mind, you don't make up. Cause like I tell you, me come from the poorest family, I will say. Mm. And at the same time, nobody wanted to harm me in no kind of way. You know what I mean? So I just walk out by instead of fighting and fighting to try to stay in America. Just let me just sign out and come home. You understand mm -hmm. what I'm saying? And, yeah, it's feel. Yeah. So yeah. What, what what was it like now when you come back at St. Kitts? What kind of changes you saw to St. Kitts? Changes? Mm. <laughs> well, development and other than development, my youngsters them take up the American culture with the bloods and crip things and you know what I mean? Mm. When before leaving St. Kitts that wasn't around. Mm. Yeah. So oh oh how do you think that came to St. Kitts though? Like, how did that translate from states to St. Kitts? But I will say, other people who have been to America and got deported the same way. Mm. That was caught up in a gang life, bring it here. And other people that have been traveling and seeing it, and others see it on TV and just follow it. You know what I mean? Mm. I mean, no. Yeah. yeah. And, and coming back to that now, I guess you were living a similar street life in the States, coming back home and seeing that in St. Kitts. How did that feel? How did that make you feel? Well, to be honest, my a feeling, to pour a feeling to it will be, you know what I mean? But I just used to stay as far as possible away from it, you know what I mean? Mm. Yeah. See, that and, much I could say. Mm. And coming back home, how did you get reintegrated into St. Kitts life? Like, how did you find a, a means to make a living? Yeah, well, as a deportee, we don't know as we don't know as human being. We don't know it's a natural survival is natural. You understand? And my father was a fisherman. He taught me that skill. You know what I mean? Mm. And. You don't know the mountain and the bushes there for everybody, you feel what I'm saying, so I just make up my mind and just figure out, well, this is what I'm going to do too, you know what I mean? Mm. Yeah. So you, you took up the fishing mm -hmm. and you started as, you, 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 you became a fisherman, yeah. you became a fisherman and how is life as a fisherman in St. Kitts? Great, great, I will say great. Great. Mm. Mm -hmm. And and the mountains, what, what specific? about the mountains really. Farming. Yeah, farming. Mm. Brain food. You know we go. Mm. You understand. Yeah. Right. So so now we're here in Shipment Yard. How did Shipment Yard come about? Like where did you get this mm. idea of Shipment Yard? Well I wanna tell you by young days living in Kenya, not even so much young days, but from one my part of them you know in Canada now. You know what I mean? Mm. Um, we also got a saying like we had a shanty in the backyard like in a garden like mm -hmm. and every time weed come there is a like shipment land you know what I mean shipment land shipment you know what I mean shipment mm -hmm. land so from there I just walk out okay shipment yard mm. you understand yeah so how, how, how did you get to the point where you, you could develop a business like a, a legitimate business out of this Well, a business, I'll be honest with you now. And next friend again, rest in peace. You know what I mean? He was like, every time mm -hmm. he come to party time, that's a man will always come get me out of my house. You understand what I'm saying? Mm -hmm. So he's like, no, he end up, he died. He died on my boat. No, he died. 24th February and he buried on my boat there. You understand? And in the burying ground, mm. I decide by I keep up this thing. In Anna, my partner, I mean, me and 
the party thing fade out. You feel what I'm saying? Mm. And I just walk out by and start to keep party. You feel what I'm saying? Oh, so it started start. from just party? Yeah. And and yeah. You, it, it eventually grew into a business? Yeah. Because after you party them now, it's like we got drinks leave over. You know mm. what I mean? And normally we just link up my friend them go on the beach, give away grill fish, grill lobster, you know what I mean? Mm. So I just figured now, okay, instead of that now, I just build a bar and just set it. Mm. You know what I mean? And how has business been for you? Great, can't complain. Mm. You know what I mean? Can't complain at all, at all, at all. Yeah. So, um, naturally, when I hear the, the name um, Struggle Card, mm -hmm. people attribute that name to a gangster. How did you get mm -hmm. the reputation of a gangster? <laughs> Friends, your associate. And mm -hmm. just small minded people at the same time, you feel what I'm saying? Because to defend your family, I don't see how you could go along in the book as a gangster, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. To defend anybody you love, I don't see how you could go along in the book as a gangster. Because remember, we don't play offense, we only play defense. So it's mm -hmm. like if you ain't trouble us, we won't trouble you, you feel me? Mm -hmm. Yeah. But a regular man, a regular man would say, I defend my family, but I'm not. Necessarily a gangster referred to. So how a could you do how could you call me a gangster then? I am not calling you a gangster. No, I just saying you probably for, have for the people out there, like, like uh, that's why I say the way the, the reputation came from. Mm. People out there. You feel what I'm saying? So mm. it's like and, yeah. and as a businessman, do you think that reputation affects you? Yeah, in a major way. Come on. We all know that in a major way. Mm. You can keep people away from you know what I mean? Don't even want to be around because they're going to tell themselves now at any time something could happen, you know what I mean? Mm. But far from that, man. Mm. So how, how, do you, how do you navigate as a businessman now trying to break away from that reputation? Like, Are you consciously trying to change that? <laughs> well, me, I am not a gangster, so I don't think there is much change I need to do. You feel what I'm saying? What is too big on is gonna be, you understand? So, mm -hmm. yeah, just let it be. You feel me? Mm -hmm. Yeah, just realness. It's just life, facts of life. Why you want me to go in the church? That still won't change it. Somebody might just end up shoot me in the church, you know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Yeah, so. So, do you, you ain't think. much to change, man. So, you think people want to shoot you? Well, if 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 if, if you're gonna say I got a reputation of being a gangster, come on, what else, what else people do to gangsters if either jail or you know what I mean? Yeah. Mm. So not for you personally, but for, for the youngster them we look upon the quote unquote gangsters are this mm -hmm. life lifestyle of a gangster. Mm -hmm. Um what's your message to them? Gangster lifestyle of a gangster, it don't, it don't make no kind of sense. No sense at all, you know what I mean? Be positive. Mm. Educate yourself and everything. Don't limit yourself to education, you know what I mean? Because you're out there and you're out there for everybody, black and white, you feel what I'm saying? So, mm. just stay positive, man. It's harder to stay positive than, you know what I mean? So, mm. leave the negativity alone. Yeah. Mm. And being being around street life and so what are some of them ever ever witnessed some traumatic things like being being out there yeah yeah mm. and and how do you deal with that like because most people like as a man mm -hmm. them them tend to them tend to say man not supposed to cry Man, we're supposed to um, have certain emotions. We're not supposed to be emotional. How does that affect you and how do you deal with like the trauma of, of the streets? Well, any man, any man, and if he is out, the one telling me that they don't cry. I feel what I'm saying. I mean, well, I don't even know how to break it down, but bro, crying is natural. Mm. You feel what I'm saying? When you feel pain, you cry. If your pain is an overbearing, you feel what I'm saying? So, mm. me personally, I cry. I cry. I mean, I'm afraid to say. You know what I mean? Mm. Yeah. I cry. Mm. Yeah. And over the years, how much friends have you lost to the street? Bye. <laughs> Bye. 
Bu var mı? Kondem. Bu ay peki yani. I feel. I feel well. Oh. I feel well. Nah, we nah, we nah do it counting. And we nah do it name calling, but I feel well. Mm. You know what I mean? And how do you deal with that? Like, oh, how you process that? For no say, like, ah, yesterday you there so with somebody, mm-hmm. and today them them not there no more. Mm-hmm. Like some close people. I'm sure you look. You have lost people close to you. Yeah, definitely. Definitely. How do you deal with that though? Like, how how you process that? Mm-hmm. Ah, bye. Without the marijuana, you know what I mean. And just the talk of the kids, them like, you know what I mean. Mm-hmm. Living for the kids, them like, bye. But it's a hard. It's it hard to process, eh? It's hard mm-hmm. to process for anybody, not just for me. Mm. But, you know what I mean, man? You've been going on so long that man just know to cope with it, you feel what I'm saying? Mm. Yeah. And so, oh, oh, do you see a solution to it or do you see it ever ending? A solution. Like finding a solution because oftentimes yeah. we find we can pick out the problems, mm-hmm. but to find a solution, like how oh, we can change things in some kids. Why? Hmm. It, it, it could be changed, yeah. yeah. It could be changed without a doubt, eh? Cause you don't see it already. Mm. You know what I mean? But why yeah. just a stop one few? Just mm. a stop one few. Trust me. Mm. Yeah, but it could be changed. Mm. Anything could be changed, you know what I mean? So do you have a suggestion like where where you feel like if this if this was to be done? then we probably can see some change. Uh, yeah. We could go political, right? Because Anything. when the politician them direct need to step in and do something. Because mm. I could remember they 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 they, they bash the peace eh? like mm. the campaign and the peace. I won't even use the word bash, but the campaign and the peace said so they're gonna make it better. Mm. You understand? And but nobody may know about nobody, but we ain't see nothing happening. You feel what I'm saying? We ain't see nothing, nothing, nothing mm. at all happening. Mm. So you feel like the peace program was basically a good solution towards the problem? Most definitely. Mm. And anybody, anybody in saying it say otherwise, why? <laughs> I don't know. But what about those who would say um, the peace program basically give give um, give some 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 people an opportunity to sit down, do nothing, and get paid and get paid? Are we gonna say? Are we gonna say to them? Is that way right to say something? Mm. You know what I mean. It's alright to say something, but when you're gonna see a positive movement, mm. if you ain't got nothing positive to add to that movement, mm. you might as well just stay quiet. You feel me? Mm. Yeah, and that's all I will say. Because mm. the community them was clean. You feel what I'm saying? Mm. I mean, we ain't gonna know you had a few men will sit down and we gotta push them, but come on, ain't everybody, you know what I mean? So. Mm. Anything positive too, I'm gonna also take a while. Other people gonna stay longer to see the movement, you know what I mean? So, mm-hmm. things happen. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So, you feel like the peace, the peace was a good initiative that actually helped the, pro, the, 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 the society in a whole? It was a great one. Not mm-hmm. a good one, it was a great one. Mm-hmm. Help a lot, a lot of people. You know what I mean? Old and young. Mm. Everybody help, trust me. Mm. Well, yeah. personally, I feel so too, you know, because yeah. we see where everything kind of stopped for a while. Yeah. Isn't it? Irregardless. And that kind of coincided with the peace program. So, mm. me could I never be against that. Yeah, Is definitely. Mm. Because it's positive. Yeah. You know what I'm saying? Mm. Yeah. And, and 
even continuing on on the peace program um situation too a lot of people would have said um some of the money from the peace program were being used to fund criminal activities also what kind of criminal activities what kind when them say some of the the man them show they all gonna buy a new machine with the peace money Man, see people, mm. and people gonna always got bad things to say about positive movements. You understand, and that's something that people within, you know what I mean, and who are part of the positive movement gonna got black out. You feel what I'm saying? Because, mm. like I say, easy to go down the wrong road, the negative road. You feel what I'm saying? You know, take nothing. Mm. But to stand tall and stand positive and you know what I mean? Mm. That's the hard part. You feel what I'm saying, so. Mm. So, I soon talk, we don't even entertain. You feel what I'm saying, so. Right. Yeah. Right. So, moving on from that now, um, fatherhood. Your father, right? My. Yeah. My. Say that again? I'm asking if you're a father. Yeah. Right? You have children. Yeah. Yeah. So, um, how much children you have? Three. Three. Mm-hmm. And. <clears throat> How does your life affect your, ch- your kids? Bah, in a major way. In a major way, in terms of the limit, the limit of places that I will go with them. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? And they're alone. Oh, you understand? But we yeah. be we coping. Yeah. Yeah. So, so basically, you feel like they're not giving the same same opportunities as a regular child mm, with a regular father no mm. no mm. and you know feel like um you feel you ever feel like changing your life or not not necessarily even just changing your life but stepping away from 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 certain elements or being done with certain companies would help mm. Yeah, but this is what I'm trying to tell you again. Mm. Like I said, right? Peace in the country. You mm. understand? For some reason, a little thing start up again. You feel what I'm saying? So, that put me now, mm. who used to be a part of it. Mm. To limit my step. You feel what I'm saying? Not saying I am a part of it. You mm. understand? In the first piece, in the first part of the peace program, I took the opportunity and just, you know what I mean, fly straight. You feel what I'm saying? But mm. you have to remember we was mm. and used to be a part of it. Right. And you could see what's going on right now. Mm. So People just use the opportunity and just, you know what I mean? So we put a limit to his steps, like, you know what I mean? Mm, and it that makes simple. sense. Yeah. Makes sense because even, even the peace thing, another criticism is like, um, people don't forget. Like, people who actually lost brothers, sisters, close friends, family members. Mm. It's like, them, them not going to just forget about, about everything that happened. You know what I mean? So, no, no amount of money can pay for the. The life lost, the trauma our families go through, you know. Yeah. And that's something we know, so. Mm. You know what I mean? Yeah, that's something that we know. Mm. And that's why we just put a limit to your steps, them yeah. places we go. You know what I mean? Mm. The people we might use to visit. Yeah. Yeah. Like, could change the vibes, you know, change the mood. Mm-hmm. People them say, girl, I love bad man. Mm-hmm. And look, and say, is that a, is that a true? Like, is that is that is uh, that that something that you can agree with? Well, me not a bad man, so. I well, can't not, well, not necessarily bad man. Yeah, yeah. them them love a certain mm. man, a certain, like them love street man. Then let's let's use street man. Bad man would be a bad word. Yeah, but yeah. Them, them, the people them say girls love street men. Is that true? Well, all these street men, guy kind of energy, what a woman really need, you know, you understand what I'm saying, like, mm. you won't find no 
jacket and tie man gun pull over and girl let me go in at them bush there, you know what I mean? Like, you know what I mean? Yeah, like real talk, so. Yeah. You know, it gives them one a little memories, dog, you know what I mean? Passing through. Yeah. See you like, bye. Bye, yeah, bye. I remember a man cut me up right there. You understand? Yeah, a little yeah. memories, so. Yeah. I will say, that's mainly the reason why. Mm. Yeah. What else do you feel like them girls yeah. need these days? What else they need? Yeah. <laughs> but I don't know. I don't know what one said one day. Yeah. Trust me, trust me, trust me. Mm. Mm. So, like you have a woman, a personal woman? No, no. no. You say you have a few. A few? Yeah. No, no. So you have, say I try to tell me, you just have your face, you just have pump all the time, so. Why? Yeah. But you don't know that's a part of life for right no, now, man. but. Them say if you pump too much, you lose your vision, you know? Why? No, no, man, you can't tell me that, man. You don't believe that. The people who I watch now don't believe that, neither. No, the people them more much don't believe because they know. Like, you know what I mean? I'm not a woman. But, you know what I mean? Me yeah, you have a few. No, I not have a few. You have a few friends. I have a woman. Well, you have a woman I trying to get. You understand? So, that's mm. about it, though. Mm. Yeah. So, 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 looking for a woman now and being on the dating market, what do you think a woman needs? Like, what, what do you think them girls like, nowadays are look for them? Like, you know, man, because we see social, on social media, every girl I say, them not deal with no broke man. Yeah. Mm. No, we want them what I say, they not deal with no broke man, broke themselves, so, make can understand, because, you see how me ugly, me walk out, me not want no ugly woman, so, mm. me can understand the girl, them not want no broke man, so, mm. at the end of the day, bye, the girl, them want, I can understand, like, So you spend per woman like yeah. If me will spend per woman, yeah. That's no question to ask, bro. Once once me got me woman that you lease, nothing mm. too much. To what extent? Like to what extent? Watch you, nothing too much. You understand what I'm saying? In a real life, like once me got my woman and it's my woman that me and your woman and me and nobody woman, bro. But oh you know that, like oh you know saying like, me and yours, like Well, me is a kind of man like if you're gonna fool me with words, then so be it. You feel what I'm saying because words is what me and go off of. You mm. feel what I'm saying and then a little energy. Mm. You feel what I'm saying, so. If mm. you're gonna fool me with words, well, you got me. You feel mm. me? But once me got more woman, bro. Yeah. You not got no more on anything, man. Anything, trust me. Yeah. Anything. So believe you, 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 you believe in love? What do you mean? Who 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 alive not believe in love? Tell me. It's not that I don't believe in it, but I don't really know what's love, you know what I mean? So, technically, I don't really believe in it. You know them, really? You don't know what's love? Yeah. <laughs> like, with the kind of love when I hear someone else. Head over heels for a woman, you know them, really? Yeah, but a woman can also be head over heels for you. You understand what I'm saying? Mm. Love not gonna one way. Mm. Feel what I'm saying, so. Well, recently, I visited my granny in um, Jamaica, you know. She had told me, say, if you're in a successful relationship, you have to have um, one person, one person love the other, and the ice, next ice. one, and the next one um, respect, isn't mm. it? Just here I say, love and love can't work. It's love and respect. You know what I mean? So my woman love me, and me respect her. You know what I mean? Well, at the end of the day, love and respect work hand in hand. You mm. feel what I'm saying? Mm. Your love and respect work hand in hand, but mm. so at the end of the ones you respect anything, you love them. Yeah, you feel so, what I'm saying. So you ever been heartbroken like a girl ever ever broke your heart? Yeah, them not a long time days, man. Mm. Them not a long time. One of them story, you know. One of them story, the way a girl lick your chip and you have to wonder how, no, how not, you feel, sir. No, we're not too okay. Bye. <laughs> Crazy, but. Leave that, man. <laughs> so I don't want nobody to feel like, you know what I mean? So, leave that. Yeah. Mm -hmm. mm, so and it wasn't even in saying it's neither, but... Oh, the, the we had American them days girls. There. Yeah, we had them days there. Mm. Yeah. So, so, what do do? Like, if you, if... So, for example, now, you have a woman, and you find out, say, she goes to her and... Give her the, give her the stuff, give her the goods. So, what do you do? Or, like, how oh, you don't deal with that? 
Well, I'm be honest with you, right? And this is why this is why I say what I say earlier in terms of one's is my woman ain't gonna limit to what I will do and what I will spend, right? My thing is like me don't, me don't, me don't, me don't try my best to reason with a woman just like how me reason with my friend in terms of like mm. I don't always tell a woman like yo when you're fed up just tell me you feel mm. what I'm saying instead of biting me and make me look bad because I watch here you got consequences to that you feel what I'm saying like in a real life ain't not telling what I will do you feel what I'm saying so <laughs> I really don't want to go to that so I don't be real with all of them. Well, let I them say, know. Hey, hey, everybody okay. telling me we are Hey, not telling, bro. People remember, on the 18th of May, on Pinnis Beach, Sunshine, Perspectives Media is keeping it its first official event. A thing called Enchanting Colors Affair. You see, we have the likes of Collision Band, Sweet Sister Sensia and Extortion Sound out to send kids from under Nevis and we have DJ Smudge, SG Presidential, Blackstone Family, New Level, you see me, just to name a few. And we also have the core band out of Nevis, you see me, ticket prices are 25 EC dollars, you see me, imagine so much entertainment for 25 dollars. Can't miss that, that's the big party, the 18th of May, you see me, so we are going we are going to party at the Enchanting Colors of Fear in a Nevis, the 18th of May, and then we are going to break in down the 20th, at the end of the weekend. Because it's a holiday weekend, you know, isn't me? So something is actually keeping in Nevis. And it's not an expensive party, isn't me? So if you look for a place to lime on the 18th of May 2024, Sunshine, Nevis. No, I mean, so that, that's, that, that, that's a part of my prayer to a night time and a day time. I just want you to know that too. You understand, like, keep me strong. In terms of seeing them kind of things, that like, give me enough power to walk off. You know what I mean? Mm. Like, that, that, that'll be in my prayer. That's one thing in my prayer, like, because I ain't no telling. So, mm. I don't talk to them, like, when you're ready and you're fed up. You know what I mean? We is human. I might feel some type of way because you're fed up and me not fed up at the time you feel what I'm saying, but I can understand. Yeah, mm. trust me. Yeah. Mm. Mm. And 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 what's some of them things that be like the possibility? The possibility? Yeah. Bye so far you going good for me. Yeah, <laughs> yeah so far you going good for me, me you know me. Like for instance, me and my child mother sit down and read and she tell me she fed up and you know what I mean? Yeah. You know what I mean? I feel me I wasn't even felt some type of way, but you know what I mean? It's yeah, just but, life. But, so we gotta deal with it. Why if it did come along to a situation where you walk in and somebody else did it? I strike you, yeah. Oh, you don't deal with that. <laughs> <laughs> I mean seriously, like oh you don't deal with that. I just ain't like, telling. Serious, seriously? Yeah. That's the right answer for you. Ain't not telling me about cars. You know what I mean? Ain't not telling. Mm. Bye. Ain't not telling. Mm. Believe me, me not gonna sit down like some man and say, oh, me ain't gonna do this and me ain't gonna do that. But watch here. Ain't mm. not telling me, boy. I don't feel like none of you gonna live with all your life. Sad to say. If I find enough strength to walk off, then, well, you know what I mean? Yeah. God on our side, feel what I'm saying, but trust yeah. me, man. Yeah. So it's a that's a dangerous thing, like, yeah. that would be a dangerous choice of a, of a, of a woman to do that. Yeah, man, real dangerous mm. when playing with me. Mm. Yeah, you play with things that are safe, man. Mm. Mm. Real talk. But but I'm um, sticking in, in, in the in the relationship vein now. Um <clears throat> like not having a woman. You feel like that's the way or uh, you're into the idea of getting a relationship. I always in the idea of getting a relationship. Relationship once you're dealing with a strong woman, you know what I mean? It's always good. A relationship is always good. Mm. Mm -hmm. So like how like how you not believe in a she cheating then? You believe in a you cheating as a man? Well, no, but I'm sure you be cheating now. Cheating come with a for me, for me, 
But you cheating come with a mystic kind of thing like but if you're gonna be playing with my mind too much in terms of like every minute you accusing me of something what I mean I do. It's like yeah, you're just pushing me in that direction and yeah and you understand it's just a me being fed up is what will make me do them kind of things, you feel what I'm saying. Mm-hmm. Yeah. So if a, if a, if a, if a woman um interested in a in a the, the shipment boss, you know, um what kind of qualities you are look for in a woman? Qualities mm. other than just strength and the faithfulness. Quality. To be honest, me like build me woman them from scratch, you know. Mm-hmm. Yeah. Me say build a woman them from scratch. You mean? Okay. Like me na me na try instill no quality in you and me na try. You mm-hmm. know what I mean? It's just mutual respect and you understand. It's like I don't even know what to tell you here, but mm-hmm. yeah. Trust me. And you, you love you love red skin, you man. Or you like that? You like the chocolate? Cause personally, I can like the red skin, you man. I say red skin, you man, them dangerous, but something about the red skin, you know. <laughs> Aye. Any kind of woman, bro. Red, dark skin. You know what I mean? Personality, to man. Mm-hmm. Me want a woman like. What I could make joke with, like, you know what I mean? Yeah. Mm. But you like, you like the perspective, no? You know what I mean? Mm. Like, a joke, like, real we'll talk. Yeah. You know what I mean? No, man, like, I you know you, No, man. okay, watch no, it. No, man, no, I have to girl that me done, one. Me done home with a woman, right? Yeah. No, I'm no name. And a woman come on the TV and me say, wow, bye. Sexy, bye. Yeah. And you know that's the other problem. Of course, then naturally so, that So that is supposed to have a problem. She on TV, me will never see she a day in my life. Like, come on, bro. Well, like, I mean, it, it, it no matter, bro. Like, a woman who have problem with a man watching a porn, you know. Like, woman, woman, like, that, that's a woman, you know. Hmm. Literally, you know. Hmm. Like, she would, she would got a problem with you who just watching a porn, bro. Like, and that's a problem. That's a problem to a woman. That's a problem for me too. Mm-hmm. Yeah, me know one them kind of woman, bro. Yeah, trust me. So, so you you would mind your woman watching a porn then? Why is a porn? <laughs> Video. A porn is something to make you feel some type of way about yourself. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Give you that extra urge, however you wanna do it. You yeah. feel what I'm saying? All right. Them porn stars, you know, I go see them in a real life. All right. And next thing now. Speaking of woman, mm-hmm. you would mind your woman because I don't know, since it's in this culture, is carnival, mm-hmm. partying, and things. Mm-hmm. Would you mind your woman like sugar band turn on and your woman cock up pan, pan, pan somebody in her jam? Yeah. Walking up. Yeah, well, what you know, this is them kind of thing that now we can't be my woman. I don't believe. It's my woman if she gon' cock up and somebody in town. If sugar band come on, I mean. Man, believe it's my woman, trust me. Repeat the one there again, my father. Repeat the one there again. Those in the back, the ones in the back don't hear that. Yeah, it can't be my woman if she gon' be in town, cocking up on the next man to sugar band music. She cannot be my woman. Yeah. Trust yeah, me. Me that that simple. Yeah, me know that either. Yeah. Yeah man, somebody and girl yeah, like I feel like it's, it's a common thing, like yeah, come on out your thing. Yeah. Yeah. Like you got some little waste man cock up on no, sir. Yeah, because mm. I I I I I I gonna be in tongue too. So you go text me, ask me I be and we link up if you want somebody to cock up on. Mm. Yeah, or cock up on your female friend. Yeah. 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 That makes more sense. Yeah. And more respect too. You know mm. what I mean? Yeah. Yeah. So 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 moving on from the the the, the relationship vibes now. Entertainment. Mm-hmm. We see shipment yard every Sunday. There is a, a event here. Um, how did you come up with that series? Like the Sunday, the specific specifically Sunday, like as on a Sunday night. Yeah. Um. Well, it's just like watching. You know what I mean, and just figure like by. 
just start something. You feel what I'm saying? Mm. Start something and see how we go. Mm. You is a fisherman. You feel what I'm saying? So yeah. And it's Sundays now. I just figure like Sundays are dead day. Nowhere there to go after. You don't need your your Sunday food is like. Mm. Where is there to do? You feel what I'm saying? So just come smoke a joint, drink a drink, and you know what I mean. Just mm. relax. And 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 how has that been going? Great, 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 great. Mm. Trust me. You feel like yeah, yeah, the point where um people people were saying some kind of incident at Movia where police was involved. You feel like oh shipment here get targeted a lot by law enforcement. If I say yeah, I will be telling a lie. Mm. In terms of entertainment wise, like mm -hmm. If I say yeah, we'll be telling a lie. Mm. You understand? Yeah. Okay. So. Okay, so yeah, and the police basically good then. You have a good relationship. Business. business to an extent. Yeah. yeah. To an extent. Mm. And about entertainment now, shipment yard promotions, more while we see on, on, on put on bigger events. Mm -hmm. um, how did you get into that? <clears throat> like I tell you, it yeah, all started from my friend. Mm -hmm. For me pastor, where I just walk out and just keep it up because he was a party dude, so I just walk out and just keep party. Mm -hmm. you know and I mean? what, what is it like bringing in like a, a big dancehall artist? Because I'm going to bring Joshi and Kranikla before. Um, what, what is it like putting on an event with a dancehall artist? Because me and the promoter them ball about the prices and with entourage, podium and all of that. How is that? Yeah, but if you promote them now, some you promote them going to approach these men as millionaires. Mm. Feel what I'm saying? Any any promoter in Jamaica, any management team in Jamaica, whoever reach to could tell you like, bro, this is a poor man trying something. Them is my first words to any management team. Uh, you know what I mean? Mm. Like, don't come and expect the wall. You feel what I'm saying? So, mm. that and you know, if you're going to work with a poor man, uh, you're going to you know what I mean? Bypass the poor man. Mm. But I don't put it out there to be like, but yeah, this is what to expect. This is what you're going to get. And you know what I mean? Mm. Like, if you tell me 30,000 and I only got 20, I ain't going to tell you, yeah. And then, you know what I mean? I ain't going to tell you, bro, I got 20. But you could do for me, you know what I mean? There's a poor man trying something. Mm. You know what I mean? Boom, man, man, man. Just go from there. And you find working with, with dancehall artists is like, they, they have, them, them, them deal with you properly, basically. Yeah, 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 I won't lie. Mm -hmm. Right, right, right. Now, moving on to entertainment in St. Kitts now, as it relates to, to the, the bands, because band music is a big thing here, you own carnival. Mm -hmm. um, you have a favorite band? <laughs> Are you into the band music like that? Not really, you know. Not really into the band music. Mm -hmm. Favorite band? But uh, you know, I'm not have a favorite band. I listen to any band. Mm. You understand? But but um <coughs> people have it for say uh, sugar head still because almost every Sunday Sh sugar band was the band here. Yeah, because now sugar band is the band more available. Mm. Yeah, sugar band is the band more available. Anytime you say sugar band here is because them other band ain't available, you feel what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So it's not a matter of who gonna bring out the people like who oh, nah, the man. best? No. Remember, it's a poor people thing, eh? You understand? Poor mm. people thing, bro. So mm. you no know, matter who come out, you no know, matter, you know what I mean? Yeah, mm. it's a poor people thing. All poor people. You feel mm. what I'm saying? Yeah. Yeah, building on vibes. Mm -hmm. So <clears throat> moving on to the music. Feel like you 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 have a personal connection to the music, being that your I'm a brother. Um, how do you feel about IMAX's career at this point as an artist? IMAX's career. <laughs> Bye. IMAX Ima just need to just put videos to his song, them. Mm -hmm. You know what I mean? And just just push the song. You know what I mean? Make move, make mm -hmm. connects. You know what I mean? Mm -hmm. Yeah, just use the money and book flights. You feel what I'm saying? Yeah, just take flights, that. 
Mm-hmm. Yeah. And that's and the only how you are meet people, you feel me? Right. And in terms of the music, locally you now, um, I always ask people about top five and top ten and, mm-hmm. and them thing. That, um, who, who you would say is the top artist locally? Well, you know, I don't really listen to local music like that. But if you mm-hmm. if if you want me categorize a top five for you now. Mm-hmm. Top five. Where you gonna be? You gonna be I man highlight the jewel. Chiga. Who else by? Jedos. You know Jedos? Yeah, Jedos, Jedos, Jedos bad. Jedos bad. Jedos bad. So we we are gonna yeah, we we're putting Jedos. That four. Yeah. That four? I like that four. Like Did you? Um Trigger. Trigger and Jedo. Okay. Okay. Yeah, that that are five. Yeah. Mm. So um <clears throat> But if we got weird things for the rest of them still and don't get me wrong if you don't know people or take things and view things like you know what I mean? Oh. Yeah. But I mean I don't really care of what people think when we okay. get top five, you know, cause it's my top five. Mm-hmm. If you have your top five, that's just your top five. Mm-hmm. You dig what I say? Mm-hmm. So about DJs now. You know saying kids. You really you really DJ them. Like you have a top five list of DJs. But maybe two. Mm. But maybe four. Four. Four to four. Hmm. I don't even want to sound boy or say here, man. But not a lot of DJ them though. They need to step up the game, like you know what I mean. Everybody with this one set of music, you know what I mean, like. Mm. But I will say, watch ya. Bagampo. Hell, cause I don't know. Hell is a kind of. Me not be boyos neither. You feel what I'm saying? Mm. Hell voice it you. Definitely. Okay. Then after hell, I'm put titty man. Mm. Yeah, me I'm put titty man. What? Titty man kind of underrated, but you'd voice it too. You know what I mean? Mm. Yeah, you'd voice it all. You just gotta give me chance and one see. You feel mm. what I'm saying? So then. DJ Smokes is the same thing. You feel what I'm saying? The man just need a chance. You feel what I'm saying? Well, I mean, I don't really know Smokes. Yeah, yeah. And then... But it's a, it's a controversial five. You have Hellfire, yeah. Titty Man, Smokes. Mm-hmm. I first met here, this is a five, yeah. But yeah, he, you gotta listen. If you if you is a man who can sit down and listen, like, really listen. Mm. You feel what I'm saying? You will see, like, then but you got dangles, dangles that do he thing too. That Feel that what four. I'm saying? Yeah. No more the five, but the last one. I'm thinking man. I feel like you have a limited scope of No because of, yeah, that's I, the yeah, thing. I feel too. like you have a limited scope of what you listen to because Yeah, because I, I never guess. listen smudge. I never listen crazy. You never listen to terror? I tell you, tell you, tell you, but tell you, 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 tell in terms of it got no man, energy. I first hear you. Like, that okay, one, yeah. I'll show you this. Yeah. If the energy not right, sense the music not right. You feel what I'm saying? Like mm-hmm. she's a girl and go for energy. You feel what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. May not if you understand. Like may not if you understand what I'm saying. I understand exactly. Sense it then, woman. Don't get me wrong. Nobody get me wrong. I understand exactly what I mean. I'm no, just saying. Explain. Then, right, what's then what's then explain. Top five, but you know what I mean. You know what I mean? Yeah. You just. Dog off of energy, like, you know what I mean? Your energy gotta be right for shit to be right. Mm-hmm. Same thing with hell sometimes, too. Yeah. You know what I mean? But them, they force it all, bro. They mm. force it all. Trust me. Yeah. Mm-hmm. So, um, <clears throat> speaking of the music now, allegedly, 
Last year, um, in town, an artist was beaten and the the names called surrounded your camp and your your people. Them. Mm. What would you say about that? Hmm. An artist named Carl last well, year Christmas. It, it was alleged that an artist was beaten. Alleged. Allegedly. And it's um struggle them being called. Struggle's team name being called. Is that true? As far as the artists, that ain't true. The artist being beaten, mm-hmm. that ain't true. Mm-hmm. But the artist friend, yeah. It's just like So the artist friend was beaten. Yeah. Because it's a simple situation, bro. It's like, you know what I mean? We big people. You mm-hmm. understand what I'm saying? There was an altercation a couple nights before with one of my family and it's like we ain't get a chance to adjust it and he come there and I was trying to adjust it like but I went to do it like but I was going on with you and my family what, 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 what was that what, what, what it was about the other night you feel what I'm saying mm. and he responds to me is take my hand out of his face you feel what I'm saying that was his response to me like bye take your hand out my face there you want my hand over here, you feel what I'm saying? Okay, take my hand out your face. Okay, so I just put my hand in your face. Yeah, it's that simple. Because I try to talk to you as a big man. And you're trying to tell me like, I take your hand out my face, like you're showing me fight, so. Well, yeah, give me a hard slap and I just, you get what I, mean? I don't even know what else happened. Because to be honest, I kind of fall and after that, I don't know what happened. I don't know what happened, bro. So, to be honest. Wait, you slap a man so hard till you fall? No. I don't fall. I don't slap What kind of slap that to blood clot? Jesus yeah. Christ. But you just respect, boy. I'm asking you, like, trying to find out something because I wasn't there. You feel what I'm saying? And then you're going to come tell me, but take me hand out your face and mm. you know my hand ain't in your face. You feel what I'm saying? Mm. So that basically show me now. You're trying to feel like you oh because i come with words it's like okay struggle is a little boy you know what i mean that i mean i'm a little boy i might hang with little boys i'm not a little boy but you know what i mean mm. yeah so it come down to a level of respect then. yeah because i try to fix a situation and you're trying to get out the hand like you ain't trying to hear what i gotta say so mm. if you ain't trying to hear what i gotta say and trying to show me fight mm. well i gonna bring it first because that's why i was taught you know what i mean when when in, in any situation what look like it's gonna be a fight hit first and hit hard feel mm. what i'm saying so that's what i do mm. yeah and, and just to clear it up nobody hit highlight highlight just took it up and you know what i mean because i do like attention eh? you do like attention do sing a song like you don't trouble people you don't do this you don't do that you know what i mean but i'll show you something in many cases and many situations and i don't see people go to jail because of their mouth Die mm. because of the mouth. Mm. Ah, kind of thing because of the mouth. So we all know you is an artist. Mm. So you gotta be careful and very, very careful of what you sing about. You feel what I'm saying? Because you was once over here, and now you're gonna go over on the next side and sing like like you're trying to build it over here. But I can't slide. Don't expect that to slide, dog. You know what I mean? You're dealing with the streets. Mm. If you ain't singing about the streets. Mm-hmm. That being me ain't got no problem with that, that, you know what I mean? Anything is anything. But you're singing about the streets, so you gotta put some respect to it. So you ain't respect nobody over here. Mm. That you're trying to say. So you, you, you're saying Highlight was over here, like you, you used to be around you? Highlight is an atlas man, not around me. Oh, okay. Highlight is an atlas man, me from Kayanio. Mm. Not around me. Highlight is an atlas man, Highlight family from right up the road up there. Mm. And Highlight guy to be like, he can come at least and all these kind of dummy things like somebody after he. You know what I mean? Mm-hmm. Which is far from that. You know what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. How you like brother with pastor heal me? He mother with pastor heal me. So how are you going to heal all these people but yet 
try to tear down your son. I tell your dude like attention, man. Mm. Might as well get a Jess. Yeah, and let me shoot a movie or something. Yeah. Get a Jess, man. Man mm. in Jess, don't get a lot of attention. Mm. Yeah. Yeah, uh, trans- uh, transgender really, you know? Still. Yeah, they get a lot of attention, man, from all mm-hmm. kind of people. People who are play straight but lean. You lean people, them. You know what I mean? One get a lot of attention now with them, man. Mm-hmm. Sing a guest song. Do something, man. Mm-hmm. Yeah. But it seems, it can't just be, it, it can't just be, um, the fact that him, him no longer want, want to come around you. Something personally happened between y'all for him not to, yeah. to be here. My want boy. to be here. I don't know what highlight problem is. You understand? Mm-hmm. I don't know. You feel me? Highlight. I'm a well, we ain't gonna call them on him. Mm. The farmer squad, BBM. Feel what I'm saying? I am not a singer. Mm. I never once put foot in the studio. You feel what I'm saying? Mm. So, any personal problem, I won't know about. You feel what I'm saying? Okay. Yeah. Okay. So, he's basically an outsider to, to the earth. Yeah. Mm. Yeah. And you, you, you've you never tried to harm him. You've never ordered anybody to Never, harm him. ever, ever, ever in my life. Dude, he's a singer, a talented singer. Representing mm. saying kids. You understand? Mm. Yeah. But it's just a limit to things that you will say because I understand what I'm saying, bro. Okay. You have a problem with IMAC. They had a lyrical beef or war, whatever people going to call it, however you want to categorize it, right? Mm-hmm. And it's like, okay. Bro, it's IMAC alone. You feel what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So when you're going to say, Okay, shipment yard and this and you you take it further from IMAC. Remember, IMAC is a singer. You feel what I'm saying? But it's still just musical though. Some would say it's yeah. just musical. Like no, at the end of the day, I don't fly with the streets like that. You don't fly with the streets. Watch here, it's a <laughs> You don't fly with the streets like that, bro. The music life different from the street life, so just let them keep it different mm. they keep it different but in all right remember you know, it's dancehall music you know and if you really check dancehall music like the history of dancehall music clashing culture stem from dancehall music see you know? uh, so in in clash like in lyrical confrontation yeah things are being said but, to basically okay. it's like a one-up okay like a one-up but listen to me you know if me it's and not you, necessarily if me serious. and you are clash if me and you are clash bro Mm. Me and you are clash. I only gonna clash you. Only you. This thing is about. This thing ain't about who around you. This is me and you clash. You feel what I'm saying? Ain't no way I gonna step out of bound and bring in somebody else. You feel what I'm saying? Mm. And that's just the code. That's just the code, bro. That's a street code. That's not necessarily a music code. Because I think about it now. <laughs> Byron Messiah, the big song, Taliban. Mm-hmm. Look how much street things are being said in that. Street things? Yeah, like gangster things. Like killing mm-hmm. and shooting and mm-hmm. Taliban make work and yeah, 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 go me say. It's just musical. It's just lyrics. I don't think anybody is taking Byron as a bad man. Why you, not? You taking Byron as a bad man? Yeah. Because you sing it. Jesus Christ, man, struggle. No, man. No, man. So you are trying to tell me, boy, I will never do nothing what you think? I I don't know him to do anything that he has sung about. Mm. I don't know him as a street man. Yeah, like, that's not... He, he, in, within St. Kitts, all right, let me ask you a question. Mm-hmm. Within St. Kitts, is Byron considered a street man? No. He, he goes to my point, like... It's just it, it go back to the original point of um the the the, the boy confrontation. Run, boy run sing Taliban. Mm. Who boy run? Who boy run this in the song? You got a point. Okay, now boy run sing Taliban, right? 
apart from who he this, you feel like now when you come to the street part of Trinidad, mm-hmm. the street part of Trinidad wanna like to hold by one and show him the real Taliban's. Yeah, but is okay. that right? Now? Okay. You know, right, right, fam. He's just an artist. But artists have to watch the words. This is what I'm trying to tell you. They need to watch the words, bro. You feel what I'm saying? Mm. Yeah, you yeah, have to sing. We have no problem with nobody that's singing. You yeah, have to sing, bro. Mm-hmm. And sing what you're feeling, sing your pain. Mm-hmm. You know, you, you can sing about what you ain't even doing. Mm-hmm. But fam, you're gonna involve the street and the street man name. And when I say when I say the street, I mean names, you know. You feel mm-hmm. what I'm yeah, saying? Yeah, definitely. Yeah, so that's where you that's where you're stepping out of lines now because you know what I mean it's two things. Because watch. Mm-hmm. How you like sing a song, right? Mm-hmm. And I and I and I black the other day. I won't even call it a black like a ends like them old man not be hanging out. Mm-hmm. I don't know what them old man saying. Mm-hmm. But highlight is a rat. I said, what? Why are you talking about? Baba, I'm to you. Check it out. Why I said that? And listen why your man them said that. Highlight sing a song. Use weed money and go buy a gun. You feel what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. Boy, police them have run us down over here for that years now. Planting weed, using weed money, buy a gun. Using my weed money and my buy a gun. But we using weed money and build business. You feel mm-hmm. what I'm saying? Mm-hmm. So you gotta care for what you put in your song like. You planting weed? No. He ain't planting no weed. Like, okay, I'm asking a song, right? <coughs> now, however, the media put it, the media put it like it's for he. You feel what I'm saying? But it, I'm actually subliminal, too. Like, no. there, there are songs. Too bad. We're so... talking about too bad. Mm-hmm. You understand? No, 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 no. Not me, not too. I like to have too. No, I like. I might have too bad long time. Man. Okay, so. Mm-hmm. I, then I'm. I might not sing too bad for my freestyle I won't session. say he, you know. I won't say how you like yourself felt like that song was for him, you know. You yeah. feel what I'm saying? I will say more like the people and the media. You feel what I'm saying? So mm. it's like now, okay. Yeah, like I tell them, I never been on how you like to be honest. Mm. If how you like tell them me and he ever spend an hour together, how you like would be lying. If I tell you such thing, I'll be lying too. You mm. feel what I'm saying? So like, you're 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 only offended at the fact that. He keep mentioning um, shipment yard or shipment yard was being mentioned. Yeah. Mm. Because if you go back and listen to all the highlight song them and so come on. Mm. I like a mad respect for shipment yard. Mm. Yeah dad. You listen to all the highlight long time song them when he was on the BBM. Mm. A lot of a lot a lot of respect so, for so you. So you feel like you can broke some kind of peace because more like this one. No, like, with wanna, me, wanna and like me and me and do not have a war. This is the, this is the thing, what? No, but when when people are gonna say I like um, it, when it reached the point where the public have it say I like get beat up by you and your friend. Then, but to like, see, that's what highlight was to do. Come and clear that up. But before he clear that up now, he come and sing a song. So he don't trouble people or whatever, however his song was. You feel what I'm saying? Mm. So, who do trouble people? You feel what I'm saying? Who do trouble people? You gotta be shipment yard man them. Mm-hmm. And check it out. That's it. That's yeah, so only like, set a man like, will trouble him. So, so he's, not, yeah. he's not saying it directly, but indirectly he's saying it. Come on, bro. Yeah, Nobody's and, stupid. And people read into that because but watch it naturally comments. that's what I'm reading Watch your comments. Oh, the vex because boy one must say a link in um highlight and that I'm a uh, struggle this struggle that my half of them people don't even know me bro check it out mm-hmm. yeah so, that's why that's why, that's why I'm kind of feeding into the negativity and that's why I'm kind of always interested in doing an interview with you because you always hear about this struggle mm-hmm. you know what I mean and people is almost like them them dehumanize you. You know, so he's more like he's like this monster. Mm-hmm. But me know say you're a human being. You dig me say, and yeah. I have had interactions with you. Me see you around. You never you never show me a bad face. Bro, respect for us. Mm-hmm. Mm-hmm. You know what I mean? So more while 
I don't know, fam. I, but but still, you 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 as a person, you can't yeah. feed into the media. But you just people. That's why I tell you, me don't mm. do that. Cause you just people. You know what I mean? And that's mm. the opinion. You know what I mean? You can't stop a man from feeling how they want to feel. You check it mm. out. Yeah. So don't know what things said, man. And you know, feel like there's a way where you as the bigger man could have step in and try patch up things between your brother and I like like because I feel like they had a powerful musical vibe together. First of all, right? The highlight and I mark them they got to be willing to come together and do what they gotta do. You feel what I'm saying? Mm. Yeah. Yeah. Mm. For me to step in and not knowing the problem. And which in I don't even think it's so much a problem. You feel what I'm saying? It's more musical. So it's like it's people that make it a problem. We need a problem, bro. Ain't no problem at all. Ain't no problem whatsoever with highlight. When I mark sing a song, people around highlight maybe think it's for highlight and boost up highlight or highlight maybe just go sing a song and then people well I don't know, I don't know. Mm. I don't know. And I don't want to know too much. That seems like it's musical, though. Yeah, and, and keep it musical. Mm. I want highlight and I'm to keep it musical. Mm. Because when it comes to the streets, it could weaker share and weaker share and cause a big problem mm. that both parties don't need. You feel what I'm saying? Because mm. me personally, I don't need a problem, bro. Mm. Highlight, I don't need a problem with you. Yeah. Mm. And you did not beat up highlight, Christmas. I did not put my hands on highlight bro and no hands were put on it none at all yeah i'm glad we get that clarified yeah. still you see because even me them feel like i'm i'm and funny you know some somehow around him they had it to say i was against him i don't know how that come about you know yeah but, because in saying it's now you know support got no, no opinion you know you support just see things and if somebody asks you a question you stay quiet you yeah. feel what i'm saying so from a time for answer to certain things the whole world hate you yeah you feel what i'm saying so that's one of the main reason why you just stay away from the media to bro mm. trust me so why you, why you feel like you you wanted to do this interview then? Well, because now a lot of people wanted to know like what's going on with this highlight situation, you feel what I'm saying so. Mm. I just wanted to let people know, mm. like honestly speaking, we personally don't have a problem with highlight. You mm. feel what I'm saying? Mm. So. so when we can look out for the next shipment yard um, event? Next shipment yard event? Maybe sometime in August, yeah, thinking planning something in August. Bring your artist? Yeah. Yeah. Mm. I don't know that going on. Yeah, female artist this time. Mm. Mm-hmm. Yeah. I wonder who that is. <laughs> yeah. You don't have that in the works? Yeah, we are leave them wondering so long now. Yeah. yeah. But that done in works. Done in, you know what I mean? Done in the pipeline. Yeah, yeah but you don't know the thing go. Boy, if I'm feel like this was an amazing interview. feel like people going to have things with them take away from it. But positive or negative, when somebody can take something away from this, I feel satisfied. I feel accomplished. You know what I mean? Anything else you want to talk to the people about? Struggle? Once, once there is no further question, you don't know anything. So hold on. Good. Before we go, where you get the name there? Struggle. Like, mm. why somebody, why you don't choose a name like Struggle? Mm. But you know, which man near me? Uh, my neighbor, Gumps. <laughs> Mm. Gums, gums near me. Gums, you know. Me I first, eh? So gums, you know. And my mother young. You feel what I'm saying? My mother, the kind of young when she get kids. Mm. So, you don't know it was a disco in Kayan. So gums, gums, say when disco nights and so, my mother go on disco, leave me alone home to take care of my sister and my brother, which is Imac and my sister Shani. You mm. feel what I'm saying? My little brother and I'm back. He leave me alone to struggle with them. So Gums give me the name Struggle. Oh. Yeah. And you have always been a, a protector of your brother. Yeah, for sister. sure, for sure, 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 sure. I don't know, you know. Menis, link up. We need one, one of them interview you again. You know what I mean? Big up iMac. iMac was one of the actually iMac was one of the first people them 
one of the first uh, major entertainers who forward come give perspective media interview, you know what I mean? Mm-hmm. So I always have the respect and ratings for the G. Because mm-hmm. we see the amount of talent and the potential for get out there. Very right, right. Big as a superstar, you know what I mean? But people remember for like, share, subscribe, cop one of them red eye t shirt, yeah. Is me? Visit oceans for for the quality food. You know what I mean? Well, until next time. This has been the Perspectives Podcast. Struggle. Well. Mm-hmm. Hoy, and I said nobody now believe it. Huh. Well, if they may say I mean I beat it. Me and the pastor, me not go preach it to how we all it down. Yeah, man, it's Dejo, you know what I mean? Giving you a different perspective on Perspectives Media. Easy. Perspectives Media. Another man, Perspectives Media and Sunshine brings to you a tank on the beach, May the 18th. We outside. Sunshine, Perspective Media. On the beach, May the 18th. Bang! Yeah, don't forget the 18th of May is all about Enchanted, right down there by Sunshine's Bar. Big up Perspective Media, the whole team outside. So let's make sure you're there from early. Right there, Nevis by Sunshine's. Enchanted. Madness, alright? Kaboom.